United were bristling with energy and enthusiasm and made Port Vale a good team last year look ordinary. The first goal came after just eight minutes. So simple and yet so effective. Simpson's kick headed in by Foster. It was Simpson who produced the second goal. A perfect cross for Steen to head onto the bar and it was Steen who cracked in the rebound. United were in full flow now. Foyle on the ball here, worked well to provide an opening for Simpson. Growing goal saved Port Vale. Another chance coming up. Again, great running by Mark Steen this time to create an opening. And Grew this time saving with his fingertips. Port Vale came back just before half time. John Jeffers broke on the left. Judge managed to stop his first shot, but had no answer to the header. So 2-1 at half-time, United looked in control. After the break, though, they wobbled for a few minutes. Thankfully, Judge was on form. Oxford's answer was swift and certain. A free kick, which Foster headed on for Steen to make it 3-1. But still, Port Vale fought on, and they came back with a second, a well-worked goal too. Robbie Earle, the scorer. Here's the build-up to Oxford's four. Kerry Evans was pushed by Aspin. A penalty, which Simpson banged home. At 4-2, United kept charging. Foyle missed by a fraction, and Steen might have had a hat-trick. Here's the fifth, another beauty of a cross from Simpson and Foster with his second goal. 5-2, what a start.